Okay, this is it guys, the day before the finals event. I am with our beautiful queen, Celeste Cortesi, competing here at Miss Universe. Celeste, how are you? <laughs> I'm doing great. I'm a little bit nervous right now, but you know, it's really exciting to be here. And I cannot believe it's the day before the coronation night. I cannot, I didn't process yet, yeah. to be honest, because we've been so busy. So it's impossible not to be nervous. So how yeah, are you managing your nerves? Like, how, what do you do? Do you breathe? Well, I breathe, I meditate, and honestly, I just have faith in everything that is going to happen. As long as, long as I am prepared for it, and I know that I worked very hard to be here, I think that everything will be good. And, you know, we will see who's going to be the next Miss Universe. But I'm there thinking that my mom is watching. You know, I have the best team behind me, and that's all I care about for now. So Chalessa, you are the most requested interview here, I know, because it's very hard to get an interview. And you're also the most requested for all the photo shoots. How does that, how, how does that make you feel? Well, I'm very grateful, to be honest. Uh, honestly, I don't even feel like I am tired because I'm so excited mm. to be here right now. Like yesterday, we had a whole day of rehearsals yeah. and then I had a shoot with Bra Guys. So yeah. I can just say thank you for the sponsor to, for choosing me because I'm grateful. Thank you. So what is your winning mindset? What are you telling yourself? to be able to really peak for tomorrow's competition. I'm really telling myself that I worked so hard. I really prepared for this. So I just have to go out there and enjoy the moment because, you know, God will just do the rest. Yes, this universe yes. is a destiny and I want to enjoy every single step on the stage. It is just one chance in a lifetime mm -hmm. and I really have to have fun when I am on stage and then we will see what's going to happen again. So can you confirm to us from 64, it's 16, then 5, 3? Yes. So from That's 16, new. it's yeah. 5. It's yeah, it's, it's a big cut. Oh, That's why yeah. everybody's scared. <laughs> so after the, after the, after the announced 16, they're going to mm -hmm. go swimsuit and evening gown. Yes, and then it's going to be top 5 and then top 3. Wow. So that's a big cut. Yeah. Very big cut. Let's see how it's going to happen. Celeste, I know the whole week you've been saying that it's so friendly, but I, I did, is there any like more tension or competition now between the girls? Because obviously you know who you're competing against. Well, we all know that this is still a competition, but I think that that doesn't stop us from wanting to be kind to each other and really uplift each other. I think that every single girl here is very nice and very approachable and I'm very happy because of that. And, you know, we're just here to, yes, compete, but also to enjoy the moment and represent our best, our country the best way we can. So, so to fight for the crown. Yes, of course. That's why I'm here. And this has always been my dream to become Miss Universe. I have my purpose and honestly, I was given a second chance to represent the Philippines, so I'm not gonna waste it. And you saw the crown yesterday, did you I like did. It? <laughs> huh? I stared at the crown. There is a video of me going viral oh. because I was looking at the crown because there were so many girls around the crown yeah. and then I was just looking from afar like, ah. <laughs> yeah, it's beautiful. The crown is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Thing, you're posing your walk can you tell us a little bit of what you plan to do and also about your gown because we saw okay. some video of it already during the rehearsal of the gown yes. I know. Oh, the back i think somebody took a video i know that was my prelims but i'm gonna ah. have a new gown for finals okay okay yeah so that uh, that gown is gonna be different mm -hmm. uh, a little bit of a different color as well uh, we really wanted to leave the best for last and yeah, my posing and my walk is gonna be a little bit different. I always want to have, you know, a very strong walk and yes. I really want to go on stage having fun, not thinking about anything, not even thinking about, you know, the technique or anything. I just wanna walk out there and do more posing, really enjoy the moment and that's what I'm hoping for. So what is your routine gonna be like on the competition day tomorrow? Like, you know, there's, there's yeah. what's your day gonna be like? Well, in the morning, for sure we're gonna wake up very early i have to sleep early tonight yeah. that's i have to I, at least i want to sleep six hours and then you know i want to wake up with a very positive mindset i want to do my meditation and i really want to put my head into the game because mm -hmm. tomorrow is the final night and after tomorrow <laughs> and we don't know what's gonna happen and so. then practice uh, we will practice, yeah. We will have rehearsals. So probably we will have like a dress rehearsals as well. Uh -huh. And then we will just wait for the night. How do you like the stage palace? It's a little bit short, isn't it? It is a little bit short, but I personally like it. Mm -hmm. I mean, there is much that we can do. We can do a lot of uh, stopping, a lot of twirls. So it, it's very enjoyable. And yeah, we hope that everything will be good. Okay. <laughs> and I love the music because mm -hmm. it's very uh, focused on 
New Orleans culture mm -hmm. so you know the singers the guests and the music it's really amazing and I think this is a very different Miss Universe stage compared to the past few yeah. years wait a lot of people are guessing if you're gonna have your hair up or down <laughs> <laughs> I was discussing about it with my team but uh -huh. we'll do hair down and hair up Both. one part hair down one part yeah. hair up yeah. all right so Celeste is I mean the whole Philippines is waiting with what do you want to say to, you know, the mga Pinoy na from just not in only the Philippines but even yeah. all over the world, especially in the U.S.? Well, I really cannot express how grateful I am for you guys. Honestly, whenever I see, the few times that I see social media, I really see you guys cheering for me. I can hear you screaming and I'm really grateful for you. You give me so much excitement, excitement and so much strength on stage. So yeah. thank you so much.